Hello everybody, this is Eddie from Mobile Homestead Solar Services and I get asked often what do you use on your solar? And I thought I'd give you guys a show. Right here is our newest item. This is a countertop ice machine. You can see it's making ice. My wife's favorite is her cooktop, New Wave cooktop. And this is our New Wave oven. There is my Kurg coffee maker. Just made a cup of coffee. I'll make another one to show you guys here in a second. We use we have a washer and dryer stack unit. There's our dryer. Here's our washer. We do not use the dryer, of course, because it takes too much energy, but we use our wash machine. And we actually use it on the inverter even when we're on generator because the generator tends to make the electronics go goofy on our wash machine. So we leave it on the inverter. We also have a five and a half cubic deep freeze and it's a regular residential 115 volt. If you look right inside here we got plenty of food in it. We actually have my wife, our eight and a half year old daughter and myself so gotta have quite a bit of food for that kind of a gang. Um, like a lot of people we've got our computers and we have different electronic devices, cell phones, stuff of that nature. We have two TVs in the front. I've got um, an LED TV so it doesn't take as much amperage. This is an 09, 2009 TV so it's a LCD. It uses more, um, more energy but it, it's got a pretty picture. As you can see down underneath I've got my DISH 211 um, receiver. And let's see here. I'll pull out another. We'll grab us another cup. And I'll make another cup of coffee. And show you what it's like. Okay guys. We'll show you how you make a cup of solar coffee. First thing is you better be boondocking like us and be on have your solar system set up by us. Or get someone that knows what they're doing. Oh, I tame cupper. Okay. And here comes the coffee. Now we are completely off the leash. We are west of Sedona, Arizona, out in here on 525 Forest Road in the Red Rocks. And you see, I got 100%. Oops, not too far. But my amperage is 73 minus. And all that's saying is, is that's what we're taking out of the out of the batteries right now, just for that cup of coffee. But it's still at 100%. So guys, I just wanted to give you a, kind of an idea of what you can use on your solar. Um, you know, we've had a lot of good luck with what we use, but it needs to be sized right, and um, and you need to have the correct amount of uh, of panels to match what you're going to do with it. So if you guys need any help, you can give me a call um, or email me and we can help you figure out what would work for what, what your needs are. And uh, this is Eddie from Mobile Homestead Solar Services saying God bless and happy trails.